I've managed Darren Kelly, I've got a few, few questions on the game. Yeah, no problem. Do you think we deserve the win? Yeah, I do in the end up. Um, I think when you look at the game overall, the first half, we had sort of difficulty in dealing with, with their um, tactics, if you like, because they, they play a 4 4 2 time. We worked on it on Thursday night, but we weren't just quite getting, we're still getting out too easy. Um, so we worked on it, talked about it second half or half time, um, and I thought how we come out so much better in the second half. We were more positive when we were playing, focusing on what we do. Um, and yeah, I thought it was so much better. You know, you look at the chances overall, I think we had the better chances. Um, then we missed the penalty. So delighted to get back to winning ways after last week. Um, and yeah, delighted with a clean sheet. It was certainly quite a scrappy game. What yeah. did you kind of say to him at half time to try and get try and get into the game a bit more? I, I think again dealing with what they do because I thought they, they were sort of control in the middle areas through having the overload in there with an extra man. Um, so it was important we get on top of that. Um, and as I say, we just checked a couple of things about half time. It's just a matter of digging, you know, sort of digging on and keep you know focusing on what we do, but just being obviously aware of their threat. Um, and as I said, I thought we'd done that second half and you know, you luck with a couple of good chances, missed a penalty, um, good goal, why Dom was up there, I've absolutely <laughs> no idea, but hey, we'll take it a 1-0, clean, back to clean sheets. Uh, James Paul, he's started his yeah. first game today, how do you think he did? Absolutely brilliant, I thought it was excellent, considering he hasn't had a lot of game time, um, and to be honest he could have played on, he told me he could have played on, but you know, you're sort of trying to manage him as well, and the fact that he's had a few injuries this season. So 70 minutes, you don't want to almost give him too much too soon. But I thought the 70 minutes, you can see you know, the quality and to, to be honest, it, it will only get better. So yeah, delighted to have him with us obviously for the month and I'm delighted to have a clean bill of health. I'm going into next week's training again. I thought that Luke Point made a decent addition to the game. What did you kind of tell him? Because he's obviously had, obviously had a few injuries. Yeah, he has. He? But you know, I thought Paddy Lane was fantastic. Um, again, his energy for a young lad. You know, a young lad with an old man um, sort of head on him, and the fact that dealing with situations, reading situations in and out of possession, thought it was excellent. Para come on, you know, Para brings pace and quality. Um, and obviously the setup for the goal it give him a big confidence boost because you know as you say he's had a few injuries a few setbacks a few knockbacks and you know he'll, he'll, he'll be buzzing off that and um, as I say we'll, you know he's been out doing a bit he's getting stronger and stronger and you know I've no doubt by next week hopefully he'll be back 100%. The topic this week's been Spygate do you, do you watch with an Albion do you yeah. know how they play yeah. what do you make of it all? Well, to be honest, we had somebody watching their training on Thursday. Um, over the only train over the road, so we were there with the camera and everything. <laughs> no, seriously. Really? Yeah. No, it's, <laughs> listen. You know, you, you look at Spygate. That you know, Bielsa. For me, um, you know, again, one of the best, if not the best, coach in the world. There, there's different ways of doing it, but you, you'd be surprised even coming in the R. And I know a lot of clubs at this level and the level below. Do you know? Probably put the same amount of of you know, sort of effort and um, sort of what, what you're looking to get, at, you're trying to get every nut and cranny, if it's social media, if it's, you know, we watch clips of the opposition, you know, we, we watch videos, we watch sort of the things like it today, we knew the way they were going to play and things like that, the threats that they had and how to deal with them. Um, so yeah, it goes on, there's just different ways it's been done, you look at that way, I think it's fantastic because I'm a big believer in Bielsa, so if it's good enough for him, <laughs> it'll be good enough for No, I, I wouldn't go, you know, bear in mind, yeah. we're only part time, yeah. um, and you know, we have to be here to, to obviously focus on us, but I, I don't like to get you know, too drawn, we'll do where, where you know, due diligence on, on the opposition, but you know, ultimately a bit, it'll be about what we do, you know, um, and yeah, it's been an interesting week but I think now it's it's played its part um, and hopefully now it'll just move on quick. Talking about what we do, we've got uh, Marine next week, are you expecting a tough game? Yeah, yeah it'll be a tough game, we played them down there, um, you know they went last week beat Buxton 3-0, Buxton's a good side, you know everybody in this league is capable of beating each other and it's, it's, it's very clearly shown but it's important that we go again same this week you know work hard in training go through what we need to do on Thursday night in terms of team prep for Saturday and, and go and you know get ready for 100% but the boys especially because of the back of, in the back of last week the boys will take great confidence from that you know as a team defensively you know because I, I say that team I don't just look at back five as a team you know it's how we um, how we defend from the front and you know I thought today we did it excellently and, and they'll take great confidence from that going into next week's game which again is at home which is great so it's important that we build on that you know as yeah, trying to build that really good consistency that I think we haven't really done um, and 
And yeah, hopefully we can get another three points by the time we're having this chat next week. Yeah. Brilliant, that's cheers. All right.